In this video, we will review the logic behind the pitch bar commands during a normal takeoff. In this example, both the acceleration height and the thrust reduction altitude are set to 800 feet. This altitude is not referenced to radio altitude, but to barometric altitude, with the FMC adding it on top of the airport elevation. The function works in combination with VNAV, and that is why VNAV is armed before takeoff. The auto throttle is also armed and will reduce thrust to climb power at the programmed altitude. As a reference, the pilot set the barrow bug at 862 feet, the result of the 800 foot acceleration altitude added to the airport elevation of 62 feet. Let's begin the takeoff and see all these settings in action. The sequence will work with or without the autopilot engaged. Rotate. When the aircraft transitions to flight mode, the CDU automatically changes from the takeoff page to the active climb page, displaying the first Positive commanded rate. speed of V2 plus 20 knots. This is the initial target speed commanded by the pitch bar, in this example, 170 knots. When VNAV speed replaces TOGA mode, the speed window closes, and the target speed of 170 knots becomes visible on the speed tape. This remains the target speed until the aircraft reaches the acceleration altitude. The auto throttle will select climb thrust when the aircraft reaches the thrust reduction altitude, and N1 will be displayed on the FMA. The pitch bar will then command a lower attitude to allow the aircraft to accelerate to the next target speed, which may be 250 knots, or another speed constraint published in the SID and set in the FMC. As a protection, the commanded speed will not exceed 230 knots until the flaps are fully retracted. 